What's up guys, Justin here, Jekyll and Hyde Athletics, heading to the gym, Tuesday morning, uh, bench today, see where I'm at uh, with bench, it's been going really well, and hopefully we uh, hit a pretty decent number today, um, yeah, so this week will be like, pseudo maxes kind of, not, uh, I'm not going to, you know, like failure max or anything, especially since I'm by myself, um, but we'll get, a, get an idea of where I'm at and then uh, deload. And then I think there's going to be a couple weeks of testing for the show that I might do. If that goes well, then I'll do the show. If not, then I go back to regular training. So we'll see what happens today. Hope everybody has a good day. And I will see you at the gym. Have you done, uh, you know, like regular cleans with the barbell before? Not really. Not really. Yeah. Okay. But, uh, All right. So with the axle, I'm just going to teach you the count time because once you get heavier, you're going to have to do that. Anyway. Okay. Okay. So you want to be kind of like in your deadlift stance, maybe a little bit wider. Um, I like to point my toes out. Usually when I do this, I use my. You can turn it up. That's fine. I'll do what I'll just voice up because I'm not gonna be able to hear myself anyways. Well I want to make sure you can hear me. Oh he can, he's right there. Okay, um one oh one big shoes, you don't have to do that. Flat shoes would be fine for pressing. Um so you can start with hand both hands over. As it gets heavier, you're gonna have to go over under just because of the, the size of the, uh, the axle. So the idea is to try to get it like on your sternum. Okay, so some people start put it in a crease of the hips and then kind of work it up almost like they'll start here and kind of if you can it's much more efficient obviously if you can get it right to here first okay and then once you have it here say you're if you're like this you want to squeeze in flip over quick okay and then from here I see a lot of people they're usually here now obviously when you're in this position, you're not gonna have any hip power whatsoever. Yeah. Okay, so you really wanna try to get your hips back under you, obviously without the axle falling down. So you wanna squeeze in, get your hips back under you, pop it up, okay, and then from there, it's just regular press, okay? So, um, another thing I see people do sometimes, this you might wanna, it'll come with practice. They actually start this way, and as they're coming up, let's switch the hand. So it's like, start here, and then come up, and catch it as you right. as you go. That's Obviously, that's gonna take a little bit of practice. But for now, I would just say, start here, okay? Pull it up to your chest, get your hand over, get your hips back under your squeeze your butt, and then press. Make sure, um, you know, before you, this axle is a little bent. So before you press, make sure you're nice and tight. Elbows up, kind of 
high, you know, same thing as the push press, knees out, okay, lats tight, and then press over here, okay? So let's try a few. Yeah, it's good. It's light yeah. right now. So. catch here, you want to be leaning back a little bit, because once it gets heavy, yeah. if you're standing straight up, it's just going to slide down, especially if you don't have what I have, okay? So you want to catch and kind of lean back, and then once you're ready, make sure you're squeezing in, bring, and then it's like one motion, bring your hips up and back real quick, almost like a, like a kettlebell swing, kind of. a little bit. Second one looked really good. Yeah, that second one felt pretty good. Yeah, if you could get that quick transition, that'd be good for you. Yeah.
guys uh just got done with uh client this morning had my training earlier uh bench today worked up to uh 340 for a single which uh felt really 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 good haven't gone that heavy in quite a while so definitely a pr as far as no uh wrist wraps or anything like that um and you know time wise and then uh like i said client uh hunter was in for strongman again uh, I'm really happy that uh, we got a couple guys doing strongman here now, so uh, that's what I really love to teach. So he's doing really well. We did uh, axle continental clean today, and then just some accessory stuff. Um, picked it up really quick. Good technique, and uh, I think if he sticks with it, it'll be uh, be pretty good, pretty strong. So I'm gonna go do some work now, and uh, should be a good day. Hope everybody's having a good day, and. Uh, Go do some fucking hard shit today. See ya. What's up guys? Heading home uh, from the gym here. A little late. Uh, about almost one o'clock. Ended up doing a little uh, cleaning in the back and organizing. So uh, kind of stayed a little bit later than normal. Um, good training today. I had, like I said, I had Hunter uh, doing strongman stuff today again. Uh, he's doing pretty good. Uh, Axel cleaning press today. We worked on Continental. So that'll be, uh, you guys will see how I kind of coach. I think I'm going to start making some more uh, videos like that where I'm just doing technique stuff. Um, I think that would be more beneficial for you guys than watching me drive around in my car. So um, Pete and Sean are back today. That was cool. We got, uh, you know, Pete is going through all his videos and stuff from Pan Ams. He's got thousands of pictures and videos and all kinds of shit. So. We have a lot of work to do in the next couple weeks organizing and putting things together, so um, that should be interesting. We have a crap ton of content, which is good. And uh, Pete won gold in his uh, division, so that's awesome too. And uh, yeah, other than that, just uh, work and uh, work. That's how it works. Work. Ha! Ha ha ha! Alright guys. Uh, have, I'm gonna go have some lunch, hang out with the kids for a little bit. I think Jen will be home early today, so that'll be nice. I'll see her before I go back, and then uh, I'll be back to the gym around 3 3 30 and see what happens today. See what kind of turnout we get. Weather is uh, starting to look nice, it's just about 50 right now, so maybe we'll get uh, get to open the doors again today. That'll be nice. Can't wait for all this snow to be gone. So, hope you guys are having a good day, and I will see you in a little while. What's up guys? Heading home, Tuesday night. Good day today. Uh, my training went really well. Uh, client training went really well. Jim had a good turnout this afternoon. And uh, lots of people on the mat today. Uh, what, right now when I'm leaving for BJJ, Farmiga is back. So uh, the turnout was more than usual or back to normal. And yeah, overall really good day. So uh, gonna head home, eat again. And then uh, head to bed. We'll be back here tomorrow morning, bright and early. I'm not sure. I'll probably just uh, do some work tomorrow, maybe some stretching and stuff, but no, uh, no training. So it should be fun. I will see you guys tomorrow morning. I uh, hope you enjoy the video. Please subscribe to the channel. 
Like, comment, let me know what you want to see, and uh, I'll see you in the morning. Good night.